as we head into the rest of our Friday, we're still going to hang on to plenty of sunshine, a little bit of a breeze, but that's going to help bring some relief from the heat we feel from that sun. Here's a live look out of our 13 WREX camera. Beautiful blue skies. I even picked a good day to wear this dress. You could see a little bit of that breeze with the branches swaying a bit. If anything, it might feel nice if you're out in the sun for long. 83 degrees already in Rockford, plus dew points in those mid 50s, so not too humid, at least much more comfortable than what we felt yesterday. We're still going to climb a few degrees as we head into the afternoon with that breeze sticking around, but so does the sunshine. Nice and dry, amazing weather for all the festivities we have kicking off in the area this weekend, like Rockford City Market for this evening. Temperatures still in the 80s by the time we get through the 6 o'clock hour and then the 70s moving into the late evening. All in all, still warm, a little bit more comfortable as we see that breeze as well. Overnight, we drop into the upper 50s, one of the more cooler nights, if you will, moving forward as we really kick up the heat into the weekend. Not right away though, at least Saturday is a bit of a buffer. Still low to mid 80s. We'll see a little bit more cloud cover as we continue to stay warm and not as hot. But speaking of hot, my goodness, do we crank up the heat. Low 90s by Sunday. Definitely going to be a toasty Father's Day. A really good day to be by the pool or any water to keep yourself cool. Might see a spotty shower or two late Saturday, early Sunday, but a lot of us trending to stay dry. But boys, are going to be hot and muggy. Not just Sunday. That's actually going to kick off a streak of the 90s and very hot and humid and really just oppressive weather as we head early into next week. Here's the trends that we're seeing. We'll see a lot of that warmer air moving in. Here's Saturday, so cooler air moves away, and that's when a lot of that heat moves in. It's going to be downright hot on both Sunday into Monday and even moving forward because it just stays put. We stay nice and warm into the next several days as we see that pattern moving in. And here's a neat graphic showing you really the risk and concern of that heat. Friday looking minor. Again, we're in the mid to low 80s. And then as we head into Saturday, not much of a change with those temperatures. But take a look at Sunday. This is where the 90s come in and the humidity. You see this map drastically change to major heat risk moving into the end of the weekend. And it only gets worse as we head early into next week. This is what Tuesday looks like featuring extreme heat risk early into next week. But then we get some kind of relief into Wednesday. That's actually going to be our next best chance for some active weather. So that just gives you an idea of how hot we're talking. Temperatures in the low to mid 90s plus your dew points are going to be in those mid to upper 60s. So awfully humid and warm. Heat indices might be in the triple digits as well. In your most accurate 10 day forecast, there's that chance for some showers and thunderstorms potentially Wednesday. We look to dry off potentially Thursday with some kind of chance. Looks like it stays with us even through that extended forecast along with the upper 80s, if not low 90s. Dylan.